Sure you're, all, sure you're all excited to continue this adventure with me. I know I'm excited to continue this adventure with me. We have two of the remains now. We only need to finish two more dungeons. Unfortunately, we are kind of stuck right now. We're trying to find the small key for Great Bay Temple. Or, alternatively, we also are trying to find the Gibdo Mask or the Garo Mask. And we're starting on the first day. I'm trying to think of what all we can do. Quickest way to the oceans through the west gate. Yes, I know this. Well, slowing down time is a good first start. Oh, I have no magic. Of course. <laughs> How could I be so foolish to think that I would ha start with magic? Well, at the very least, we are going to do the Deku Playground today. Or today, during this time loop. We're also going to do the... No, we can't do the Anju Cafe side quest. That sucks. Oh, we can also go to the mountains and get our sword refurbished by the carpenter. First things first, playground round one. At the very least, we get 50 bucks for it, and then we can go to the carpenters. Hi guys, it's me. Oh, it only oh yeah, I forgot it only costs ten rupees. Thank goodness the first day is of uh, this is easy. I don't like it when the platforms start moving horizontally. And I still almost missed. This is off to a great start. Whoosh! I suppose I could give Swamp Archery some more tries as well. Because I uh, almost completed that last stream, but the guy kicked me out before I could. Because apparently he closes up at like 8 o'clock sharp. Or maybe it was 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock makes more sense. We win! A new record! Oh, that's right, I can't have Google Chrome open, otherwise it's going to lag the game. First place I'm actually going to go is Sovereign Swamp. Oh boy, thank you Twitch for telling me I can now gift subs on my own channel. I really appreciate that. That's what I was looking for, Chateau Romani. Oh, that was the fine. Wait, that was the final bottle? Really? That was the final bottle? But I had never checked here? I had never explored that grotto? Wow. Apparently I had never explored that grotto. I thought that I had. No, I'm pretty sure I did. Because I got the Chateau Romani, but all my bottles were full. 
but it gave me another bottle. Did I just forget to mark that I had it? No, I, I just don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know. I'm not complaining. I have unlimited magic now. Now we're gonna do Swamp Archery. Wait, why am I doing this? Goron is faster. Amusingly enough. <laughs> Let me play, mate. Alright. Did I miss one of the wolfos? I totally did, didn't I? Oh, I missed that one as well. Doggone it. Maybe they'll reappear. Probably not, but maybe they will. It's so hard to move your aim just a little bit. I missed two of the Wolfoses. You're gonna have to try harder, mate! Alright, fine. I'll try harder. Wolfos's sounds weren't randomized. I would be able to hit them more easily. Or I'd remember. I'd be remembered to. I'm not saying this right. Because the wolfoses have a different sound effect, I'm not alerted like, oh, there's a wolfos here, because I don't recognize the sound effect. All right. Well, I'm doing pretty well for myself. Perfect! Alright, with 23 seconds remaining, that's definitely going to give me the best score. Please be a small key for Great Bay Temple. A recovery heart? Really? Had I already done that? Did I just not get the other reward? Okay, so I have to do it... Not as perfect. Like, I have to have almost no time remaining at the end. I still have to get it perfect, but I have to do it slower. So I won't I won't shoot those Deco Scrubs down at the end. Until I have, like, no time left.
This is essentially animal abuse, the game. No. Shoot him. Good. So now I just have to wait till I have almost no time left, and then I'll shoot this guy. This is so dumb. No. Good. If I had admit... There we go. That should give me the second prize. Another- wait, what? I definitely got the best pot. Okay, fine. What a ripoff artist. Oh, here's a question. Did I ever actually complete the Keaton quiz? I can't remember, actually. I know I failed it quite a few times. <laughs> oh, I also need to go to Romani Ranch to get whatever opponent's psalm is. Hello! Darmani is a Goron? How many cows are at Romani Ranch? There are three. The name of Clock Town's Inn is the Stockpot Inn. How many members are in the Indiegogos? Uh, five. Andrew's father's name is Tortoise. We had not completed it, so we get the Giant's Mask. That's good to have for the boss of Stone Tower. I like that. Now we're going to get our sword refurbished. We're such an easy Chateau Romani to get, we don't need double magic, I just realized. Because we have unlimited magic now until the end of the cycle. And they actually change it to a hot item, so we don't even have to give over our sword. Nice touch for the randomizer's part. Alright, now we need money. Because I gotta buy a powder keg. Luckily, I know just the place. <laughs> it's called the bank. Because <laughs> we've gotten all the bank prizes now. Hey, bro. I just need 41 rupees. Actually, no, 31 rupees. Oh wait, maybe we haven't gotten all the bank prizes. Or maybe we have, I forget. One way or another, we can just kill the bird. Hello! I would love to buy a powder keg. How even the guy who's clearing the road is like, oh crap, that's a powder keg.
Ugh, that was a creepy sound. Hey! <laughs> hey, girl! <laughs> this is also fitting music for the aliens, to be fair. <laughs> Yeah, I'll try. Oh, piece of cake with iron with iron knuckle, Epona, and the Lost Woods theme cheering me on. Oh yeah, I can totally do this. I'm a good aim, I promise. You guys saw me clear swamp archery on an emulator. Also, does anybody actually use Epona to take out the pose when they actually come? Or the aliens? I mean, it's so much easier to do it on foot. I know doing it on horseback looks cooler. It gets you the girl points, but like, come on. Practicality is more important. Hi, Epona. <laughs> Get out of the way of Iron Knuckle Epona. That would be hilarious if the Iron Knuckles made. <laughs> uh, that's a nice sound effect. A piece of heart! Let's see... I'm gonna go back to Woodfall Temple, get the Pendant of Memories, just in case we need it. One thing I'm worried about is I may have found the Great Bay boss key a while ago a, in a previous stream, and I forgot about it. That is completely possible. And I really hope that's not the case, but it might be. That's right. Just a recovery heart. We don't need that. Just shoop. That's the technical word for it. Shoop. Wait, that's the wrong chest. Oh, it's the room where we have to kill all the Gakwabs, of course. I think it's this chest. how it keeps all the dialogue. Like, you might not understand the grown-up matters related to this pendant, but okay. <laughs> uh, Great Bay. 
We gotta go back to Spider House to get the letter for Cafe. Or from Cafe, rather. Back here yet again. Now we gotta play the long waiting game for the mailman in Clock Town. Admittedly, I could have slowed down time earlier. Not really sure what else I could do. I think I've done just about everything I can do. I do believe it's time for the t -t 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 turbo button. As much as I love the <laughs> Mario 64 file select music, we're going to fast forward through this. Alright, so Deku Playground. At least the first part of the Couples Mask side quest. I don't know if it'll lead anywhere, but at least Andrew's going to give us something in the kitchen when we talk to her with the mask after she gets the letter for Rum Cafe. Hello. Oh wait, do we also have, we also have the captain's hat, right? Oh, we do. I forgot to put that on my tracker. Which means we can also explore the first of the graves in Akana Graveyard. All right. So he's giving her the letter. Now we talk to her. Very good. Now we can skip the time. Hey, Mobius! Welcome! <laughs> nice dragon with sunglasses emote. Alright, so now night time has come. We're gonna go to Ikana Graveyard, open up the first grave because we didn't do that before. And then by the time we get back, it should be late enough that we can meet up with Anju, get the thing from her, go to the next day, do playground level two, get our quote-unquote upgraded sword 
from the Carpenters. <laughs> oh yeah, it's all coming together. Hey, Epona. Good girl. <laughs> Look at all those emotes you got. You're a star. Oh yeah. You've been watching a lot of streams? Also, I think you missed it, but the girl who was playing my Ocarina of Time custom randomizer seed, she got gifted literally 100 subs for her channel, and you were one of them. I think Proxima also got one. Like, some crazy person, like, gifted a hundred people who at some point had watched her stream. <laughs> like, uh, gave them each a sub. It was fantastic. Alright, Akana Graveyard. Open it up. Did she stream today? Uh, no. I don't think so. Although if she's streaming later on, maybe I'll raid her after my stream is done. I could do that. Can I at least use my great fairy sword? <laughs> That's cool. Hey, bats. There's another chest in here. And it's gold plated. Oh. Got my hopes up. <laughs> oh well. Could be worse. Oh wait. <laughs> I was shooting at the wrong place. There we go, at last. Thank goodness I have unlimited magic. Alright, come on, Iron Knuckle. Green it. Take that. All right. What could be behind? What could be behind curtain number one? I hope it's something good. It's a Snowhead Temple Stray Fairy. All right. <laughs> it will make a fine addition to my collection. Oh. I did a really bad job of, because it doesn't, my tracker doesn't save whenever I close it, so I have to just manually put the stuff back in, and I missed quite a few things. My bad. Yeah, that didn't take as much time as I thought it would. We still have to wait a few hours. And now we wait. What's nice about the 3DS remake of this game is that you can use the Song of Double Time to skip forward individual hours, not just straight to the beginning of the next night or the next day. That was really useful. Good camera. Alright. <laughs> She'll be here soon. 
Yes, there's a 3DS remake of this. They actually changed quite a few things, too. Like, all of the bosses you have to fight in a different way. Some of the things are... Some of, like, the extras are in different places. Like, they swapped a bottle with a piece of heart. Uh, there's an extra fishing game that you can do just for fun if you want. I ultimately don't like it as much. At all. But, it's still good. Hey. How about giving me a small key to the Great Bay Temple? Or the Garo Mask? Nope, she just filled my bottle with milk. Well, gee, thanks. <laughs> See if I help you again. Oh, also, I need money. <laughs> Thank you so much for helping me out. Here, take some milk. I, I already have milk. Dawn of the second day. 48 hours remain. Alright, we'll put the lighter in the mailbox. Playground round two. That's a creepy giggle. Oh yeah, the music in this randomizer is great. I wonder if you could randomize the color of the Deku flowers. That would be fun. Sometimes you get tired of pink. Especially when your tunic is pink. Hey girl, I'm back. Even Tattle's, like, some of Tattle's lock-on colors are pink as well. Alright. These ones that move on the outside are the bane of my existence. But sweet, I got the first one. Rest should be much more manageable. Should be the keyword. Yeah, getting that last rupee, that's the nasty part. We got it, though. Excellent. Fifty dollars is mine. I've just got to really hope that the carpenter gives me something nice for refurbishing my sword. Because I'm running... I don't really know where else to look. I feel like Majora's Mask randomizer, I get stuck much more easily than I do in the Ocarina of Time randomizer. Was that worth it? I have to do it on... I have to do that minigame again on the third day in order to, you know... Because you normally will... In the vanilla game, you get a piece of heart if you do it on every single day. Because there are three different minigames, one on each day. If you complete them all in the same cycle, then you get a piece of heart. Hey, please give me something good. I mean, that's not awful, but... Oh, boy. Okay, well... Hmm... Running out of pla yeah, running out of places to check. 
Really, my last hope, really, is that that Deku Playground free game, free mini games lead to something good. Because right now, I desperately need either the small key to the Great Bay Temple. If I don't get the small key to the Great Bay Temple, I need either the Garo Mask or the Gipto Mask. Otherwise, I'm just, I, I'm, I'm stuck. Like, I can't do anything. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna hang out here, then. We're just gonna hang out here until the mailman arrives. In the meantime, I think... No, I'm not. I'm just gonna wait here. So how's how are your days going, everybody? My day's been going pretty hunky-dory. All things considered, got a nice walk right after work. I'm planning some ideas for visual novels. You're going to be bored as heck. Yeah, I, I heard that you lost your job, Mobius. I'm really sorry about that. That that really sucks. I, a lot of my friends are either out of work or they're in, they're, they have work, but they're really, really, really unsatisfied with their job because their job is absolutely crazy. So, so many of my friends are looking for for a job. It's it's rough. It really is. <sighs> my only suggestion, basically, is apply everywhere. Anywhere you're willing to take a job. Oh, man. This is boring. Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. Oh boy. Okay, so one thing I should mention, Mobius. My original plan for the visual novel I was going to make, with the song that I requested that you make, I'm not doing it anymore. Because it was going to be a mod for another visual novel, and I've played a mod someone else made for that visual novel, and it's basically exactly what I wanted to do with it. Like, it's basically the same as what I wanted my mod to be, so I'm just kind of scrapping the idea. And instead, going to make something more original. Still very much in the... Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. <sighs> Mainly because I was thinking it was an ambitious project I was thinking of. Like, it would have taken years to actually make it. And I'm like, well, with that amount of time, I may as well just make something original. You know? My own story, my own characters. So I'm, I, on my walk today, I was kind of thinking up various ideas of what I could do. I've got, I've got a couple of ideas. I'm trying to think of which one would work best, which one I would actually be able to do. And if so, where I would take the story. All right, mailman should be here any second now. Yep, there he is. Hey, dude, don't mind me. I'm just going to sneak into your house. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I'll just wait for him to come back. Hey, bro. I'm also very worried that, like, the small key for Great Bay Temple I had already gotten, and I just forgot to put it on my tracker, so I'm like, I, I didn't get one of those, what are you talking about? If the Deku Playground leads nowhere, then I will. <laughs> I'm gonna have to look something up in the seed spoiler, because I, I genuinely, I don't know where else to go. Hey, dude. Yeah, if you've got a lot of free time, definitely practice something cool like music. That sounds awesome. That's kind of one thing I'm trying to do is even I ha I'm I have a job, full time job, and things are getting crazy there. But I'm trying to be more productive with the free time I already did have. So I'm ideally trying to play less video games. I'm s I still like recording and streaming them because I like interacting with people in like the Twitch chat and in the comment section and such. But I'm trying to play fewer video games just on my own. I'm trying to actually, like, do things like exercise or make visual novels. You know, productive stuff. Hey, 
may, maybe try to pursue a relationship. I don't know. I'm keeping my options open. Hey, Andrew. I did, but this might end badly. That face was so happy. All right. One thing I'm also gonna do, now that I have, well, no, 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 hang on. I already explored Great Bay Temple with Great Bay Fairy Mask, so that's not gonna work. Nope, it's literally just Deku Playground or Bust. Or maybe there's like a maybe there's like a random fane in Termina field that I didn't get. I think, for me, the biggest, the toughest thing about making a visual novel is going to be getting the visuals. Because there's no way that I can do the visuals on my own. I, I will have to hire somebody to do that. And that, that might be expensive. I don't know how much people would charge for stuff like that. I also don't know how long it would take to make all the visuals. And I feel like if I get multiple artists, the art styles might end up clashing. I don't know. Wait. Sorry. I didn't mean to take off my mask. <laughs> they didn't know who I was until I put on the mask. <laughs> art can get expensive, especially if it's good art. Which, obviously, I would want. <laughs> also, if I put voice acting in it. I'm not sure if I would put voice acting in it, though. I might. I'll see. Big money, big money, big money. Why were all the rupees kind of skewed? Well, that sure wasn't worth it. All right, well. Oh, boy. So now I'm going to have to look up potential spoilers. Very confused. So I just. Well, this doesn't make any sense at all. So I just looked at the spoiler to see where the small key for Great Bay Temple was. It's in the Stone Tower Temple. So I have to do Stone Tower Temple before I can do Great Bay Temple. Or maybe. No, wait, no. Maybe. No, no, no. Maybe I don't. Because I. Never mind. Hang on. One final thing I can search for is the Great Bay Temple boss key. No? Okay. Everything I need to beat the Great Bay Temple is hidden behind Stone Tower, which I need either the Garrow's Mask or the Gibdo Mask in order to enter. 
but I can't get either of those because both of those are also hidden in Akana. So either there's a way to get into Akana that I don't know about, or this seed is impossible. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to look this up. Maybe there's, like, quirks about the randomizer hidden within the readme. Because as far as I can tell right now, this is not possible. Because the, yeah, boss key is hidden in Akana Canyon for Great Bay Temple. Small key for the Great Bay Temple is hidden inside the Stone Tower Temple, which is in Akana. The Garo's Mask, one of the two things that you can use to get into Akana, I believe is also in Akana. Or no, it is in Akana. And then the Gibdo Mask, which is the other way you can get into Akana Canyon, is on the moon. Which you need to beat the Stone Tower Temple before you can get to the moon. So I don't really know what's going on. It would suck to have to end the stream here. Uh, boy. Maybe there's a way... Did I, like, have an, a, a flag checked accidentally where it's like it doesn't have to be possible in order to be... I hope not. Oh, wait, what? Maybe I just looked at it wrong. Okay, apparently... Okay, now I'm now I'm even more confused, because I I looked at the spoiler not just in text... in the as a text document, but I opened it in Google Chrome. And apparently the Garrow's Mask is hidden in the Snowhead Temple, but I thought I got everything in Snowhead Temple. And I thought it said it was somewhere... Okay. You know what? At least it's possible to get. I'll take it. Apparently there's like one stray fairy that I must have missed. Okay. confusing. I could have sworn that I got every stray fairy in this dungeon. Oh no! That sucks. I how you, like, bounce ever so slightly, even if you just destroy a snowball. The per 
precision Goron rolling controls, man. They're so great. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Better watch out, cause I'm on the loose. I'm amazed that people can get all the way to the end of this, to the entrance of the temple, in a single roll. Yeah, Goron rolling is frustrating, to be sure. Alright. Oh, wait. Apparently it's this way. Oh, wait a... Okay, if it's where I think it is... Oh. No! That's wrong. Okay, there's a chance... Oh, I bet I know. I bet I know how I missed it. Because in the room that it's in, there's a single stray fairy that's just flying around, and I only went into that room when I didn't have the great fairy mask. So if I didn't just randomly pick it up, then there's no way I would have gotten it. I'm, I'm not making much sense. I'll show you. Oh, I'm ticked. Oh, I could have gotten this so much earlier. Yeah, there's just a stray fairy flying around in here. There it freaking is. The Garrow's Mask, or the Garrow's Mask. And now we can finally enter that accursed canyon. Still need to find the Elegy of Emptiness. But that's okay, it'll probably be hidden in a Kana Canyon somewhere. On Donner, on Blitzen. Off to Clock Town. Wow. I'm glad my seat wasn't broken, though. <laughs> yeah. That dog is has a very weird sound effect to it. Get, get out of here, dude! Iapona. Finally, we can enter here. It also took me a very long time to figure out the Gibdo Mask can also help you enter Akana. Because in the vanilla game, it's impossible to have the Gibdo Mask until you can enter Akana. This means we will get to do the Couples Mask side quest. This is wildly inappropriate music for Akana Canyon, but alright. Alright, that's Seikon's hideout. Whatever.
Alrighty. Let's find some good stuff in here, please. Once I get Elegy, then that's like it. <laughs> Small key for Snowhead Temple. Don't need it. Because I can bypass one of the doors with the fire arrows. May mayhaps, maybe I won't do key sanity again. <laughs> Loving it! Hey, dude. Alright, now we get to fight every mini boss. Well, most of the mini bosses. Oh boy, it's the easy one. <laughs> Watch this. Even having three of them doesn't make them any harder. Mmm, yeah. Mask of Truth! Alright. Which means I can finally get hints. <laughs> if, you know, you need that kind of thing. Oh, hey, dude. It's the mini boss that just gets copy and pasted over and over and over again. You just realized what the music was? What was the music? This guy became a lot easier once I realized that he makes a sound, the real version of him makes a sound, whereas the others don't. So you'll hear like the... That's the real version of him. Alrighty. Present time, present time. Open the present, see what's inside. It's... A Snowhead Stray Fairy! I am one away. <laughs> Man, what are all the Stray Fairies in the Stone Tower Temple then? Because there are 15 of them. They're probably Sculptula tokens. Or Great Bay Temple. Did I say Great Bay Temple? I meant Stone Tower Temple. Yeah, this, this is the Fire Temple music. Alright, I believe this is Wart. Yeah, it's Wart. Hey, Wart. You're like one of the only tough mini-bosses in the game. Bombs can actually damage him even when his eye is closed. Ah! 
There we go. Yes. Now he's more manageable to deal with. There we go. Goodbye. Yeah, he's actually a tough fight. Master is also tough. Because he's so dang fast. There we go. At least he dies really quickly to Great Fairy Sword. Blam! Oh boy. Hi, dude. Give me my prize. The Gilded Sword? Um, not what I was expecting. I thought that the... Gibdo Mask was going to be in here. Is there another chest up high? No, I don't think so. But perhaps I was mistaken. Oh no, this was the wrong thing. I think I, I must have been looking at Mask of Truth was there instead of Garrow Mask. I thought Garrow Mask was there. Oh, well. All's well that ends well. So I gotta see how the hint system in this works. Whoop. <laughs> Almost went a little too far there. Mystical Stone responds. Its words are heard in secret. It seems that Rededs that appear in a Kano Castle. Yeah, that's not helpful. I already knew that. Are you kidding me? That knocked me off entirely. Why does everything have to be so difficult? No. Are you kidding me, Link? Just shoot the guy. It's really easy. You have unlimited magic. There we go. Good boy. Oh, it's like a Kana Canyon, the land of the dead. It's playing the happy bob on battlefield music. All right, finally got the owl statue.
Did I keep saying Clock Town was Toad's Turnpike? No, Clock Town was Mario Raceway. Sorry. This is Toad's Turnpike. Well, this is completely unfitting. brought the unthinkable into a land as dark as Akana. My servants have fallen namelessly before the light that guides you. However, the darkness in which my servants live is, after all, fleeting. You shall see with your own eyes. Just what kind of a thing true darkness really is! <laughs> Out of my way, I'm trying to burn the curtains. Ooh, I love his reaction. <laughs> now I'll burn your other curtain. <laughs> it's coitus for you, Rocky. Take that, and you just sit on your butt and do nothing. Until now. Egos do Wicana. <laughs> Killed him by turning my back to him. Oh, thank goodness I got the compass to <laughs> the Snowhead Temple, which I've already beaten. Thank goodness I would have been lost without that. Still dancing even when he's on fire. A for effort. Uh, well, that's not good. You could do that. What? I did not realize. I think I've always used the bunny hood in the past, but no. You can literally push the ceiling back up. Definitely doesn't feel intended. Geronimo! Oh, fun. This room. 
Oh yeah, I've, I've heard a lot of Mario Kart 64 music in this rando seed. I don't like this part. We get it, dude. You can hold the very high note. You don't have to keep holding it. That's a heart container. That's worth it. See how far we can go in the bottom of the well. Loving it. Bada boom. Hey JP, welcome. To be honest, I I definitely don't know Majora as much as I know Ocarina. Not even close. Oh boy. <laughs> like I, f I was afraid I was stuck in the seed, but apparently there was one thing I forgot about in the second dungeon. Oh no. I forgot I don't have Gipto Mask. Don't kill me? Don't kill me! No, no. Sorry, bro. I feel bad about killing you, because I know you're not evil, but still. Ugh. Ah! Thanks. Take that. Ooh, creepy crawlies. I'm gonna need a few of you. Oh, wait. No, I'm not. I, I don't have... <laughs> Stupid, Artie. You don't have the Gipto Mask, so no, you don't need those. Uh-uh. Alright, bye, Gipto. Bye, Gipto. I don't want anything... Don't want anything to do with you. Uh, hi. Another one. <laughs> There's another. Oh, yes, the Tiku Nut. Oh, boy. I also oh, God, I, I keep forgetting there are Gyptos outside of every room. I I mean you no harm. Yeah. That's right, without the Gipto Mask, you can't do any. Get, get off of me! Alright. Well, we have Song of Storming. Song of Storming, Song of Storms. Oh, we can also do the Poe Hunting minigame.
Nope. I am not playing that as a Goron. No freaking way. I'm being human, Link. <laughs> yes, I would like to kill all of your finest pose, please. <laughs> I'll do it, but I'll probably hate myself in the morning. Take that. Man, that's really easy when you have great fairy sword and the light arrows. Aw, oh, but I didn't get to pick up the money. Oh, seems you healed this. Take this already. Oh, it's a piece of art. It's vanilla. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Excuse me, sir, but am I under? Am I correct in assuming that you are under the control of the devil? That. Why is it whenever I input down on the D-pad, it's like Zora Mask? Okay. <laughs> oh, this is funny and fast. And <laughs> fast forward. <laughs> Later. <laughs> now we grab the mask that looks like a moon. It's the house that plays the horse race music. Don't mind me, I'm just a rock. <laughs> plays slightly disconcerting music. <laughs> That's a lot creepier in the normal version where it doesn't have the happy music. Wow, Moomoo Farm? For this? Really? <laughs> this is very, very unfitting. This really touching father-daughter reunion, and it's playing, like, the farm music. I got $50. Wow. Tingle, I hate you so much. <laughs> I use pure light to pop his balloon of darkness. But he's got stuff to sell. Hey, Tingle. <laughs> Alright, uh... Yeah, I'll buy the Stone Tower Temple. Stray Fairy. Still... <laughs> Need the Elegy of Emptiness, though. But at least I can get into Wakana Canyon. So I do believe... Okay, that was a little... too far. Hey, on. There we go. Really, Zorum? You, you can't go up there? Really? Oh, and where is the ocean title deed? I forget where that is. But that actually could be important. Ocean title. Oh, that's right. That's just at the bomb shop. Oh, sweet. Well, then I, I'm going to go buy me an ocean title deed. I 
because I got to give that to the Deku scrub who's here. I can, too, use all of this. Fifty dollars? Fine, now I'm gonna have to go to the bank and withdraw some money. I don't like doing that. <laughs> Wait, it might be 200 rupees. I can't remember how much the Deku Scrub charges. I'll just fill up my lot. Alright. So we go to the Deku Scrub, buy his fame, give him the deed, fly over, get the token, and then wait for Seikon. Those rocks can send me that flying that far, apparently. Hey, bro. I do need a Great Bay Temple Boss, boss Key! That'll be important. But unless I have the small key as well, I don't think it will be. Here's your ocean title deed. Well, I should mark that I've at least found the Great Bay Temple boss key. I still can't actually reach the Great Bay. Yeah, I need the small key as well, so I can change the... Uh, or I can... Actually, no, maybe I don't. No, I don't think I do, actually. Alright. Check it. The Fierce Deity Mask seems to be somewhere in this world. Cool. I don't have that yet. Yeah, I'm gonna hang out here. I debated doing part of the Great Bay Temple, but... Because I think I actually can reach the boss with just the boss key. I don't need the small key. Because I have ice arrows. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. Seikon should be coming up pretty shortly. Yep, here it comes. To ruin the day. This is my first time actually doing the Couples Mask side quest in a randomizer. So now at this point, I think I'm just... I think I'm literally just the Elegy of Emptiness away from Go Mode. Once I get that, I believe I'm in Go Mode. Thank you. 
I wish you could actually get the sun's mask. It's a cool mask. And now we get to play as Cafe. <laughs> Yes, I'm aware that I'm on a time limit before it falls down the gutter. Oh, and with the fast pushing, this is going to be even easier. Oh, think. Don't worry, Seikon hired the best guards money can buy, Deku Babas. Deku Babas. Oh no, not Deku Babas. Whatever will I do? There we go. That wasn't optimal, but that's okay. Take that. <laughs> Oh no, now I've done it. Oh, the mask is so far behind. And then it's just warp, so it's like, just in time! Alright, now he's gonna get back to the town, which means... Yeah, okay, it's midnight, so I've got five in-game hours to play the Great Bay Temple. It, it could be done. It could be done. <laughs> wow, he's he's really running far. I am very glad that they still keep this music vanilla. Because this music is just so good and so fitting for the situation. Alright, slowing down time. <laughs> Gonna try to beat Great Bay Temple. The new wave bossa nova. Hey, bro, climb on my back. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. We've got milk. So we're totally set. Oh, yeah. The dungeon music actually overrides the last hour's music. first. For some reason, I'm like, this will save. No, it doesn't. Nope. Zora Link? Are you kidding me? You need to freaking grab this. Yes. Oh, thank goodness that's so fast. Hey, Marty! So, Marty, how the randomizer works is that the D-pad uh, has the transformation masks mapped to it, as well as the ocarina. And also, um, what you're talking about is not the menu, but rather the, that's the tracker that I use to keep track of what I have and what I still need to find. So that's actually a complete, the thing you see on the left is a completely different program than the emulator.
You gotta be patient with this geyser because it's too jumpy. He doesn't like it. Oh, I hope I can do, do this. To, to, maybe not get everything in it, but like at least reach the boss and beat it. And Zora controls you. So apparently last time I was in here, I didn't have ice arrows. Now that I do, though... Oh yeah, take that, take that. That's the door I can't get through. All right, it'll be easier to just soar to the entrance again. Wish I had Fierce Deity Mask for the boss. The boss is quite a pain in the butt without it. Thank you, YouTube, for giving me interrupting pop-ups. Oh, I so appreciate that. Is there another red pipe I have to turn on somewhere? Uh, of course there is. Nothing's ever easy. Follow the red pipe. Did I, have I mentioned before how I really hate the underwater controls in this game? Because I do. There are, di there are times where I actually prefer the constant boot switching in Ocarina of Time. An ocean spirit! It's my tw Oh, I forgot to mark the, another one since it's 25 now. Alright. That's right, we do need ice heroes for this. about the Ocarina of Time water temple, but man, man, this this water temple is so much worse. So much worse. normally sculptulas in the temple, but I've 
they're normally only in the Sculptula houses, but I've randomized those so they could be anywhere. And yes, I'm not... I'm not sure if I would go so far to say that this is my least favorite temple in the game, because I really don't like Stone Tower. But this is definitely one of my least favorite 3D Zelda dungeons. It's cool, and it's definitely different from the other water dungeons, but I don't like it. I don't like the Zora swimming, which is a problem. Also, once the one hour mark is down on the timer at the bottom, I have to be in stock pot in if I want to get the couple's mask reward. Or whatever it turned into, that is. Which is a pretty tall order. Hate this room with a passion. This room will thankfully be a lot less annoying because we've got arrow swapping, quick arrow swapping. Chests that's elusive. Be something good, be something good, be something good. That's not very good. Oh, that really sucks, though. I do like what they do with the water in this dungeon where you have to freeze it and unfreeze it to make all the machinery work. That is really, really cool. Doggone it! I hate this dungeon. 
All right, well, forget this. I'm going to run out of time. There's no way I'm going to get through the dungeon, so I'll just have to stall of soaring out of here. Got to go back to Stockpot Inn, and then we'll have to reset time. Then we can see about completing the Great Bay Temple in the next time loop. Get me out of here. I was about to say, why was it playing... <laughs> why was it playing Frappy Snowland over the last hour's theme? But it, was, it only did that for about a second. Likewise, now this is going to turn to the final hours. That's cafe coming in. Oh, thank goodness we got bomb chews. I know exactly. <laughs> I'm sorry, a bomb chew. And here he is. Fairy fountain music. Eh, I, I, it's fitting. Oh, that's it. <laughs> yeah, that really wasn't worth it. <laughs> I'm not going to end the stream just yet. I kind of want to beat Great Bay Temple. Goodbye, y'all. <laughs> That's definitely what Link is saying. Alright, dawn of the first day. Hopefully we can find Elegy of Emptiness. Also disappointed I haven't found the bunny hood yet. That's one of my favorite masks. First things first, we're getting 100 bucks, so we can buy that key again. We're gonna get 100 bucks, we're gonna buy the key, we're gonna get the Chateau Romani. And bada beam, bada boom, off to Great Bay Temple. Not necessarily in that order. I definitely have a love-hate relationship with the Majora Randomizer. It's it's like 90% really fun, but then the 10% you're doing the really tough minigames or trying really hard to find the one thing you missed. It's a drag. Because the checks are just so long. Alright, there we go. Unlimited magic. Gotta love unlimited magic.
I guess this means we can just go to the end of Great uh, Stone Tower Temple really quickly, though, because we don't have to get all the keys. And we have the light arrows. <laughs> and we will we'll have the boss key. So that'll actually be... Oh, but that means we can skip Gomas, who's, like, my favorite. Gomas is, like, actually, like, might be my favorite Zelda mini-boss. Uh, Nintendo Addict, hello, welcome. No, I have still have not found the double magic, but it doesn't really matter. Because there's a really easy to get faint of Chateau Romani. So I have just have unlimited magic. The, the one and only faint I need is the Elegy of Emptiness. So right now, I'm going to do Great Bay Temple, and hopefully one of the treasures I still haven't found in there will be the Elegy of Emptiness. If not, well, I don't really know what to do at that point. Because I've basically checked every single other thing. For all I know, the double magic meter could be what the Fierce Deity Mask used to be. It's entirely possible. Already done that room. Always forget to push the lever at the very beginning. Always. I'm on to it. Push it. D-pad makes everything in this game so much better. So much better. And one thing that I really like about the D-pad in this dungeon in particular, quick arrow, or it's not the D-pad, but quick arrow swapping is really, really nice. So, like, you can pull out your bow and then just with a tap of the R button switch from, like, ice arrow to fire arrow instead of having to constantly pause. It is so nice to have. Lush. Still recovering hard. All right. Is there a pipe leading? Yes, there is. There is indeed a pipe leading up from there. Oof! Oh, Link, that's got to be painful. <laughs> So I'll just start with this. Why not? Oh yeah, it's this room. You suck. Get out of here. Well, thankfully, I've already been through this room on a previous time cycle and don't need to collect the stray fairy again. Or the chest that used to be a stray fairy. Taboosh! Still not as painful as becoming embedded in the rock in Zora's Fountain forever. Is uh, is that a feint? <laughs> or 
or is that what happened to Jabu Jabu? Well, it's nice about having unlimited magic. <laughs> Just be Zora Shield all the time. Okay, twenty seven of the ocean sculptures. And all is well. <laughs> no! Get out of here, you stupid piranha fish. Get out of my ice. You are not welcome here. It's a soft lock glitch. Swan dive into the rock and lose the last bit of your life right as the timer runs out on the diving minigame and you're stuck there forever, undead. How would you figure that out? It seems like a very involved process. <laughs> Get out of here, Remy. I'm not eager to make Ratatouille today. I bet this probably lags the game, having the shield on all the time. I don't even care. This is an evil stray fairy right here. Like, how would you even figure that out? Apparently that's all I have to do. Speaking of evil stray fairies to get... This one in the middle here... Oh, that's right, it's just Vaughn. Well, you know what? Might as well grab it. Might as well. That way, if there's a stray fairy that I forgot about... No sweat off my back. Alright, get in the tunnel. Oh boy. In your face. I really hope there's nothing in the chest that's normally the ice arrows. I don't have that small key. There we go. The Earth is saved. Zora Link, you really, really suck. You need to do better. who say that the diving and Zora controls in this are great, like, what are you even talking about? Is that back? I mean, that's not where I need to go. This is where I need to go. But, what the heck was that? The camera changed. Did a complete 180 for literally no reason. That's right, because the camera sucks. And where did the music go? I'm so sick of the music just getting cut off for no reason at all. That's why you don't randomize the fanfares. Alright. I'm 
very happy at how fast that animation of you pulling the lever is now. <laughs> In the original game, it took like 20 seconds for no reason. Reverse the current. All right. I knew that. I knew that geyser was gonna go up. Nothing like failing that jump 400 times to permanently cement it in your mind. Don't jump there. Until the current goes down. Alright. <laughs> it's pipe time, Woody. Why wouldn't it let me go in there? There we go. It let me go in that time. Here we go. If you use a levitate cheat to get past that room with the wheel stopped, what would happen to the currents? I don't know. Maybe you could swim anywhere you wanted. That would be nice. But no. <laughs> Egyptian swim all Hebrews out of the water. I hope at least one person gets that reference. jumping on this so much. <sighs> A plus jump, Link. That was super good. Blast that, blast that. I am desperately trying to get all of the all of the stray fairies, because any one of them could be the elegy. Guessing nothing spectacular happens. Probably it has two states flipped and not flipped and defaults to one of them. I wish it. I wish it had a state for there's no current, so you can swim where the heck you want. <laughs> oh, real smooth, Shrek. <laughs> Uh, well, that was useful. Oh yeah, that's right. Now I remember why I hate this room, because you have to use ice arrows to get across the entire room. Just to get to a chest that you can't even see unless you already know it's there. Good game design. There we go. You better have something good. <laughs> oh boy, it's the Mask of Sense! I wonder if giving the lady a mushroom uh, randomizes something. That'll be something I'll have to think about later. Haven't I already killed you fish like five times now? Whatever.
Skullfish infinitely respawn because they suck. I... okay. That's a pretty good reason to infinitely respawn. Oof. Ah, I almost missed that. Alright. There's just one door? Yeah, there's just the one door. Cool. Never have to go to that room again. Oh, yes. The seesaw room. I still to this day don't understand what determines whether you just go like Ugh, stagger a little bit and what like <laughs> sends you flying. That's the way out, isn't it? Or does that lead to a chest? No, 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 that leads to a chest. Alright, Remy, I don't want to cook. <laughs> this part is also really unintuitive to me. You have to turn to Zora Link, because he's the only one who can climb up there. But then you turn back into Yun Link. Done yet. Oh boy! Wowzers, mister! I got ten arrows! There's the last Woodfall Stray Fairy. I have all fifteen now. Well, that's nice. Maybe the Great Fairy will have the Elegy of Emptiness for me. couldn't tell, I have not done the Great Bay Temple very recently, so I am still rusty at it. I am not doing things in the optimal way at all. Alright. But I think that might be everything. That one just has a red ruby in it, so I'll pop it just for funsies. Swim on the pipe. Come on. Yeah. This, I swear the camera actively works against you in this game. 
You saw, I literally did a complete 180 to try to get me to jump off the cliff. Alright. Georg time. No fierce deity mask, so that we'll have to fight him the new old-fashioned way. I used to think you had to throw the boomerang fins at him. No, you can use the shield. Still have this really long boss intro cutscene? Really? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> All range mode. <laughs> Alright, Georg. You are one of my least favorite Zelda bosses ever. Because you can literally just eat me for no reason and there's nothing I can do about it. But he's already at his second phase. Yeah, it's like, oh, he wants to eat you? Yeah, then you're getting eaten. Suck it. Like, how in the world are you supposed to dodge that? I had my shield going, and he still ate me. Not to mention, I'm not even damaging him, even though I'm very clearly smashing him with my shield. Oh look! He ate me again! It's li I literally can't do anything to him. Take that, you what? Get out of here! Georg has some weird programming behind him. He does really crazy things if you use the levitate glitch. Um, I don't know that glitch. <laughs> oh, look, it's a map! Is this the map of the Great Bay Temple? It sure as cuss is. Oh, well, at least I got Georg's flippin' remains. Alright, okay. What can I do now that the water in Great Bay has been cleared? I think there's the Fisherman game now that I, that I can do now. And then I can go to Woodfall and deposit the Stray Fairies <laughs> in the bank. Oh, that's not the right way. The fisherman's game is over here. So it's amazing how the fisherman has like a boat that automatically drives towards him. Hey, bro. Okay. 
Yeah, so this game is really easy provided the camera works with you. So that's a big if. change that just so I would miss it. Well, camera's being a little bit of a button right now. I'm trying to use my headphones to determine where, what, what side the torch is coming from. Like, none of the minigames in Majora's Mask like, that fun. I mean, very few of the Ocarina of Time minigames were that fun either, but, like, at least those were shorter than the Majora minigames. Like, I feel like the only fun Majora game is the Honey and Darling, uh, Bomb Skip Ball game. That one's actually pretty fun. But other than that, you've got, like, all the archery games kind of suck. The treasure chest minigame is a like, Goron is just downright unfair. Deku Playground's not very fun, and it's time-consuming. The other Honey and Darling games aren't that fun. Yeah, like, are you guys seeing the camera and how it's... Alright, that's it. That was enough, right? A small key for Stone Tower Temple. Alright, I can get behind that. I just need to find the elegy. Let's go to Woodfall. If it's not in Woodfall, maybe I missed one in the ancient castle of Akana somewhere? That's certainly possible. Hate that scrub. Just for that, he's going to burn. Oh, the beaver race also isn't fun. It, it's kind of fun the first time, but you, it makes you do it four times. Although, thankfully, you can cut it to two in this. Uh, whatever bad minigames are there, there's so many. Saving the barn isn't that fun. Oh, I guess the horse race is kind of fun. Oh, it's the postman's hat! <laughs> yeah! Maybe we can go and get something out of the mailbox. Maybe someone deposited the secret to the Elegy of Emptiness into the mailbox. Hey, bro. <laughs> the Kokiri Sword. I already have the Gilded Sword, so that sucks. All right, then. Uh, let's see. What else can I do? Hmm. Well, I guess I'll check Ancient Castle of Akana again. Because I only did the left side, and there might be a chest on the right side that I'm forgetting about. I 
I don't have the LG, right? Yeah, I'm missing the LG. I'm like, <laughs> it wasn't just a case of I forgot where it was. Toad's Turnpike in the castle. That, yeah, wait, not so big now, huh? Oh, yeah, best three dead. Oh, this butt again, really? Don't you ever get tired? guy like 10 times in this game if you get 100%. Just leads to the powder keg area. Hmm. All right, so there's nothing else in there. Where does that leave me? Maybe I should check the guide again. Trying to think. Is there anything else in Great Bay that you can't do until the water has been cleaned? I don't remember. Hmm. Maybe there's something else in Ikana that I missed? Ah, screw it, I'm looking it up. Okay, well, yeah, I looked it up and I'm really glad I did, because I would never have found it. Apparently I missed something in the Swamp Skulchula house. Somehow. Even though I combed that whole area extremely thoroughly. Block my path, you get a light arrow to the face. <laughs> I normally don't like looking stuff up like that, but I mean, I literally would not have found it if I didn't. Because I was so certain I had gotten everything in here. Apparently there was like one Skulltula out of the 30 that I missed. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, that sucks, because I could have... If I had gotten this earlier, I would have been able to get to Stone Tower way easier. I think it's somewhere in this room. Actually, no, it's not. I don't... Well, maybe, maybe it is. There it is. Yep, Elegy of Emptiness. There was one beehive I didn't destroy. Alright, well then. We are officially in go mode, ladies and gentlemen. Except I, there are some other small keys that I need to collect, and I need to collect the boss key, so... I forget where those are. Stone Tower boss key... Okay, I can get that. Small key. Stone Tower Temple. Alright. One is... Okay, that's really close. That's also really close. Okay. So one of them is right next to the Swamp Sculptula House, one of the small keys for Stone Tower, so we can grab that real quick. One of them is also in Summer's Swamp, I need to buy it from the Deku Scrub. And one of them is in the Snowhead Temple boss, it's the in the boss key chest. I don't think we need that one though. I don't think we need that one. Why did that knock me around when it doesn't every other time? Stop it! I hate dragonflies. Get out of here. Yeah, this is a small key. <laughs> a small key is exactly what one would need to open a small door. can finish the seat tonight, though. Alright, hey, bro, hey. Yes, I would love a Stone Tower Temple small key for 10 rupees. That would sound lovely. So we have three small keys. I think there are only four small keys for the entire Stone Tower Temple. And one of them is definitely for when it's uh, right side up, and I don't think we ever need to make it right side up. Ugh, that's creepy. Gonna pick up a red potion. Don't mind if I do. I will never get tired of a Pona that sounds like an Iron Knuckle. It's too fantastic. <laughs> are you are you guys seeing this? Epona's stuck. Epona is stuck. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I've never seen that happen before. <laughs> Thank you for getting unstuck, Epona. That was very nice. Alright. <laughs> There we go, I've been trying to kill one of those bubbles on horse back for a while now. Hey, Shiro. Here's your red potion. 
Now give me the boss key. Dun 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 Yeah. So I barely even had to do anything in Akana Canyon. That's fun. You would have preferred 30 minutes of opponent stuck? <laughs> I would not have. That would be a very bad time. Alright, off to Stone Tower. Now we get this to start the very slow ascent of up Stone Tower. Which mercifully will be made much faster by the D-pad. Ocarina of Time Randomizer, there's the instant Scarecrow song. Can we get the instant Elegy of Emptiness statue in this? That would make this so much faster. Does anybody actually enjoy using the LG of Emptiness on these a whole bunch of times? I don't. I'm just going to speed up this a little bit. My turbo button barely makes things go faster and it mutes the audio, but whatever. Uh, I don't care. Oh no, not a Beemos. I hate Beemos. Yeah, I don't know how to make my turbo button go faster than it does, but it's real slow for a turbo button. Ouch. Oh, oh stop it, you stupid Venus. Don't you have better things to do? I think we have to do that one more time. I guess that's one thing that can be said about Majora's Mask. A lot of the puzzles and stuff just is it, aren't that fun. Which is a right shame, because it is such a fantastic game. And the world building is so good. Let me up here. 
That's right. Yes, owl statue. Last one in the game. Thankfully, we can just cut straight to the chase. I think we can shoot that gem from here. I think, I hope, I can see it poking out a little. Rude. Very rude. Very precise shot. There we go. Yes. Turn it upside down. I hope I don't have to do anything when it's right side up. Also, this is terrible music for the Stone Tower. This is really terrible music for Stone Tower. <laughs> Don't fall. <laughs> if you do, well, I don't exactly know what'll happen, but it won't be pretty. <laughs> ben Drown time. We've been using the Ben Drown statue for a while now. Alright, I can't remember exactly the fastest way to get to the boss room, so you'll have to bear with me. Oh yeah, I forgot about those stupid wah, wah enemies. I don't like them. Camera! 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 Work with me! Camera did not want to work with me. Don't care, I'm in go mode. Oh, yeah, you're no fun. Okay, well, we can't go that way. That, that just leads to a chest that I haven't even made it through yet. Come on, where's the door? Oh, there's a door up there. Much like Great Bay Temple, I have not played this t uh, temple in a while. Come on, are you serious? Oh, and now the camera's not going to work for me either. So I'm just going to have to blind <laughs> do that. Alright, small door one, number one. That's slightly disconcerting. 
But hopefully we can get some arrow pickups pretty soon. Oh, look, arrow pickups. I do like the gimmick of this dungeon where it turns upside down. I just feel like it's not very well implemented. It's not fun. It's like, oh great, it's time to turn the temple upside down. Not like, oh boy, now I get to turn the temple upside down and do more cool things. Yeah, like this this room. Really simple puzzle. It just takes forever to do. It's like all that work and you finally open the door. And guess what? We fight this guy for the 50th time. Seriously, get a new get a new mini boss. shot early. Alright, now I just have to avoid fighting Gomez. Well, actually, if I fight Gomez, I'm fine with that, even though I don't have to. He is my favorite mini-boss ever in the Zelda series, anyway. Like, he should seriously be a boss of his own. He's that cool. I believe... I want to say that Gomez is straight ahead. Shot that from here. I don't think I can. I can shot this. Alrighty. That's the one I need. This will lead me to the boss. That would be nice if it was a piece of art, actually. Because I could use a health refill. $20. Not quite the same. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, I don't want... 
like how this dungeon is just like, oh, here's some more chests that are upside down for you. It's like, I don't want that. I'd prefer right side up chests. All right, here we go. It's boss time, Woody. And we even have the giant's mask. Twin mold. I gotta say, getting to skip like three quarters of the Stone Tower Temple, that was nice. These guys are so much more annoying on the 3DS review. Oh, this also means that Majora might actually be not stupidly easy. Because I don't have Fierce Deity Mask. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Where's my staples button? I kind of dig the uh, that theme as the boss defeated theme. All right, give me my piece of heart. You feel like you just won the horse race. And now we get to wait for the clock tower to open so we can fight Majora. Oh yeah. A single, a single bird. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, we have twin molds remains now. We never did find the Great Bay Temple small key, but that's okay. Dawn of the second day. Looks like the only things we didn't get were All Night Mask, uh, Bremen Mask, Bunny Hood, Gibdo Mask, and Fierce Deity Mask. And then some heart containers. Kind of curious what all the chests were inside the uh, Stone Tower Temple since all the uh, stray fairies were replaced. <laughs> Just in case the Majora fight turns out a little bad. Hey, bro. I didn't know I wanted to uh, take money out of the bank. 
I need 151 rupees, please. Hey, dude. Give me all the red potions you have. be dying to Majora today. <laughs> I doubt I would anyways, but you, you never know. So now we just wait for midnight, which is admittedly not very fun. <laughs> Don't worry, we also have milk. That's sure to save the day. If times get really dire. Oh, there's another red potion. Oh, I should have. Should have drank the milk. But it's okay. <sighs> I wonder, is there like a fast forward? No, I think there's only turbo. <laughs> we're wait, we're wait, we wait. Actually, while we wait, I should look at the spoiler and see what all was in the stone tower temple. Or what all I missed. Alright. Let's see all the stuff I missed. Well, that seems pretty normal. Stock pot in. Uh, Grandma stories both gave purple rupees. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot the hand in the toilet gave us the fire arrows. That was great. Uh, let's see. The all-night mask was just a magic bean. Forgot about that. <laughs> the postman's uh, bunny hood game gives you a swamp sculptula spirit. Fantastic. Oh, if, if I gave a mushroom to Kotake with the Mask of Sense, I would have gotten $20. That's pretty great. Already did all those. Did all those. Did all those. Ch -ch 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 -ch. just gives you a fairy. Not even like a stray fairy, just a regular old fairy. That's nice. in the ice arrow chest. A piece of heart. That's great. Uh, let's see. Oh! Oh, doggone it. Apparently I never beat Captain Kida and got his chest because that had the bunny hood in it. Well, that would have been great. I could have gotten that so long ago. Oh, man. Well, what, what you gonna do? that. Beneath the, the cow, underneath the well, you can milk it for a piece of heart. We 
already got the mirror shield chest. Uh, the chest on the left in the bottom of the well had a piece of heart, and on the right had a snowhead stray fairy. Let's see. There were three chests in Stone Tower. One had a Great Bay stray fairy, one had a Swamp Sculpture Spirit, and one had five Bombachus. Stone Tower Temple, we had a piece of heart, two Stone Tower stray fairies. Oh, the Great Bay Small Key was in there. Great Bay, Stray Fairy, Two Pieces of Heart, Silver Ruby. First Deity's Mask was in there. Stray Fairy, Piece of Heart, Swamp Sculpture, Ocean Sculpture, Bremen Mask. Oh, Double Magic was in there. A Shield was in there. Piece of Heart was in there. The All Night Mask was in there. Another Ocean Sculpture Spirit, another Great Bay Stray Fairy. Very nice. The Moon has a Piece of Heart, a Swamp Sculpture Spirit, a Red Ruby, a Silver Ruby, the Gibdo Mask, a Piece of Heart. And then a uh, Stone Tower Stray Fairy. Cool. And now on to the boss. There we go. Now we're on the moon. Hey, kid. I want to play. All right. Time to fight Majora. I got the Great Fairy Sword, though, so... I don't need the Fierce Deity Mask. Oh, I should also at the end see what the, all of the 30 of the Sculptula tokens and all of the Great Fairies gave. Hi, Majora. What music is this? It's an epic song. Yeah, how do you like that? Yeah, it's final boss time with cool music and without the fierce deity mask. So it's actually kind of tricky. <laughs> so this is Star Fox. Deploy all units. Charge! Your 
Luigi's Incarnation is one of the weirdest Zelda bosses ever. What the heck is it doing? Actual like bosses remains are more annoying. Take that! I'm expecting epic music for Majora's rap. That's not epic music. That's the mini boss music from Ocarina of Time. I've never seen that move before. Ouch. Alright, you know what? Also, how have the remains not died? There we go. There we go. Whoa. Did it just throw its eyeball as, like, a disc? It sure did. Goodbye. The boss would be a lot more dangerous if you didn't get so many iframes after getting hit. I agree. It's still an epic fight, nonetheless, though. Bye, Majora. <laughs> Bye, Woody. All right. Two things, or a couple things I want to check. So, the Great Fairy Fountain in Akana Canyon gives you the Giant's Wallet. That's pretty cool. The, let's see. Great Fairy Fountain in Great Bay gives a single Swamp Sculpture token. All of the ocean Sculptula tokens give you... <laughs> wow! The reward for getting every single one, all 30 of the ocean Sculptula tokens, is a single green potion. That's truly spectacular. Snowhead to uh, Great Fairy Fountain is the map of Snowhead. <laughs> That's fantastic. And... Last but not least, the reward for getting every single Swamp Sculptula is... Let's see. Swamp Spider House reward. Oh, 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 this is too good. The reward for clearing, for getting all 30 of the Swamp Tokens is the last Ocean Token. So you have to get all of the Swamp Tokens to get the ocean token, and then you have to get that one and all the other ocean tokens just to get a green potion. That's... <laughs> that is a new low. <laughs> that is so fantastic. So literally the only thing that I didn't get that... The only two things that I didn't get that I wanted were the, the Fierce DD Mask, which was in Stone Tower, and I would much rather just skip two thirds of Stone Tower than get the Christ, uh, Fierce DD Mask. And the other thing I missed, and apparently I never ever got, which I thought for sure I checked that, was the Captain Kita chest. Apparently I didn't. That gave me the bunny hood. That would have been really nice to have. Oh well. What you gonna do? That's the Majora's Mask randomizer, everybody. It is 9.30. I'm an old man, I'm going to bed in an hour. Cause I gotta get up at 6.30 for work and I need my beauty sleep.
<laughs> All right. Well, next time I do Majora, I'm either going to go even more random and just do every max random setting, or I'm going to scale it back. I feel, I feel like randomizing the Skulltula tokens was a mistake. <laughs> I feel like that's just not that fun. Because I went to the swamp, school to a house, and basically got everything I needed except for like, a few things. Like, all the important items were there. And then it's just like, oh, no, there's, there's just Skulltula tokens everywhere else. <laughs> oh, child fishing in Ocarina of Time, you once got five Deku Nuts for it. <laughs> Honestly, the fishing games in Ocarina of Time aren't that bad. Like, they're boring, but I can get out of there in, like, 30 seconds. Of course, when I make custom seeds, I just turn mini games off. I would Nintendo Addict. I would totally be down for a co-op seed in the future, like absolutely, because we did one for Ocarina of Time. That was super fun. We just would need to coordinate times to do it, because I know you don't really like doing them in one sitting. I can do an Ocarina of Time random seed in one sitting, but it's it's it gets kind of unpleasant by the end. <laughs> but I'm totally cool to divide it up as well. Yeah, some, sometimes when you do Ocarina of Time fishing, like, yeah, if the fish gets away, like, randomly, it's like, oh, well, this sucks. At the, if the fish, like, gets away with the lure and, like, isn't in the spot it's normally in, I just leave and come back, because it's honestly going to be faster for me that way. <laughs> Nintendo, did you want to do another co-op Ocarina of Time seed or, another, or a co-op Majora seed? Because the Majora Seeds are going to take quite a few sittings, I think. <laughs> Even for me, and I can do like a, a huge amount of the randomizer in one sitting, I need three streams to do a single Majora Seed. Sometimes four. If I'm really unlucky, five. <laughs> oh, I love the credits music in this. It's so good. You were thinking of the Majora's Mask randomized? Co-op with co-op co Majora's Mask would be neat, but yeah, it would likely be a longer game. Oh, for sure, and we we would plan for that. Oh man, you you're able to do child fishing in usually like five seconds, but in that rando, you were there for over thirty minutes. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> that's me with the Gerudo horseback archery. I freaking cannot do that. Like, it's hard enough for me to do that on the actual N64, but if I'm having to use an emulator controller, like, oh man, just forget that. You turn off the fishing minigames? For Ocarina of Time, the only two things I turn off are the, the horseback archery, because, like, I can't do it, and it just takes forever, and ten big pose, just because it takes forever. I always turn off Big Pose. And likewise, if I do future seeds of Majora, I will turn off the archery games. <laughs> Especially Town Archery 2. Like, that... That... They just forget it. I can do Swamp Archery. Town Archery... I can do the first prize, but not the perfect score. You think for your custom seed you made big posts required, but you only had to get one? Okay, yeah, that's nice. That's nice. I forgot you can randomize the amount of big posts you need to get. I'm also like, if I can get enough people interested, I would totally want to make a custom the custom seed I mentioned like a, a while ago, where it's like you start with everything, you just have to find the Ganon's castle boss key, and it could be literally anywhere. If I could get a bunch of people who are racing to, like, get the key first, that, I think that would be hilarious. <laughs> you like doing the big pose, JP? I think you are in the minority there. Hey, girls, I didn't see any of you because these t the randomizer skips you all. <laughs> I 
So I just wanted to I just want to note this. In order to get a single green potion, you needed to get all of the Swamp Sculpture tokens, all of the Ocean Sculpture tokens, and all of the Great Bay Temple Stray Fairies. And all of those could be literally scattered anywhere. <laughs> ah, I love this game. <laughs> yeah, next time, I might, I might still randomize the Stray Fairies. I actually kind of like that in a weird way. I would not randomize the Skulltula tokens again. Like, uh-uh, no way. <laughs> not, <laughs> just, I'm glad I tried it once. I would do it again if I did a max rando Z and randomized every single thing I possibly could. You'll find me the fishing for both rando and not rando and show you me the difference. I think fishing is way harder outside of the rando. Or maybe it's, it might be even the same thing. I know the big fish, oh, in, at least in the randomizer, the big fish always spawns near, like, the half-submerged log in, like, the center of the pond, which is really nice. I think it, it might also spawn there, just in vanilla as well. And the rando was just stupid. I mean, hey, I, I believe you. People have definitely had their issues doing certain things in the randomizer. One thing I have issues with is save stating. I can't save state. <laughs> or I can save state. I can't load states, though. It crashes my emulator. I also don't have a fast turbo button. I wish we saw Adult Cafe. Oh, and now the sad part. And then Link leaves as if nothing happened. But now he has some cool new masks. And a shield with a screaming face on it. And a Pona who sounds like an iron knuckle. Also, I wish there was a way you could randomize just the music, but not the fanfares. Because randomizing the fanfares makes some of the music cut out. Which is a pain if you're in the dungeon. I like that little fanfare at the end. All right, that's it for this Majora's Mask Randomizer Seed. Thanks, everyone, for watching. This was a lot of fun. I will likely do more rando seeds in the future. Nintendo Addict, I'm totally up for the co-op seed. If you want, just hit me up, and we can work out a time. Anyhow, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your night. Hope your work week goes well, and have a great day, and God bless. Hope to see you for future streams.